do you anchor your sub points in the minds of your audience so that they're memorable and that people act on them long after they hear you speak? Well, the answer to that question will be found in this daily dose of public speaking wisdom. Yesterday, you were introduced to a concept called the parts formula. This is how you craft your sub points to your overall message. This will increase the likelihood that people not only remember what you say, but they'll take action on it. In that video, you heard about the P in parts. That's the phrase. Today, we'll discuss the A, which is anchor. How do you anchor each of these sub points in the minds of your audience? Well, there are several ways you can do this. The first anchor, which is anecdotes or stories. Anecdotes are just shorter versions of stories. Whenever I talk about the power of business storytelling, I share the story of where I learned this secret. It was when I was doing a financial planning seminar years ago for a group of women. There was a bad vibe in the room, and I was struggling sharing slides and giving numbers, and at one point I stopped, and out of desperation, I shared a story about some financial struggle my mother had had at one point. Once I told that story, the, whole room, the, the atmosphere in the room changed. They were more accepting of me, and it turned out to be a great success. It was because I told a story that I connected with that audience. That was an important lesson to me, and I share that with others. That's an anecdote that I use to tell people the power of story to sell their message. Tomorrow, you'll hear about the second type of anchor, the analogy.